If you get cut by a knife, the knife didn't cause the pain, the cut didn't cause the pain, your brain turned on that pain in response between the communication happening between your body and your brain to alert you, something's wrong, attend to it, take care of yourself. With these threat assessments, they can be for a physical threat or an emotional threat. It's the exact same processes in our brain, the exact same neural pathways that are enacted. And sometimes your brain and nervous system are going to make mistakes and they're going to turn on symptoms when you don't need them. And then fear is the fuel that keeps those symptoms going and makes them chronic, specifically fear around the symptoms. If you're panicking and freaking out every time you have symptoms, that reinforces to your nervous system, something is still wrong. We still need to be on high alert. We're still in danger. It is not time to turn these symptoms off. And then we turn those symptoms off by facing that fear and diffusing it. So then that fuel source for the symptoms is gone and the symptoms are no longer needed and they go away.